Recently, I made a super simple, super sturdy, multifunctional workbench. In this video, I will show you how I made the main part of the workbench just to use hand tools, without any power tools, and also with no old workbench or saw horses to work from. And in the next video, I will show you how I made the front vise, tail vise, pop-up bench dogs, and other accessories. I will show you a pretty specific process to go from the initial idea to finish the piece. But first, let's start up from drawing the sketching. I took half an hour into sketching on paper. I use a ruler to make straight lines, as I'm definitely not good at drawing stuff. I took inspiration from many other workbenches out there online, such as Robo Workbench, Nicholson Workbench, and finally I decided to go with a very unique but sturdy enough and easy to build design. After the sketching, I decided to model it on my computer to get the accurate measurement. But before that, I need to decide the sizes of the timbers and vices I choose. So I searched on my local lumber store's website. I chose 2x4 treated pine for the laminated legs, 2x4 untreated pine for the laminated bench top, and hardwood for the apron. I ordered a front vice screw and a tail vice screw online in advance. The software here I use for modeling is SketchUp. For the design, I have three goals in mind. First, it should be easy to build with hand tools. So I designed several simple mortise and tenon joint without any screws or nails. Second, it should fit my height and my stature, and it should be heavy enough. Third, it should fit my needs for comprehensive woodworking purpose. 